Ah, oh, my pretty little raven. I think that's a crow. It's supposed to be a raven, but I think... Well, okay, so let's take a look at our... No, not that. Let's take a look at our quest line. I think I have to go to the map first. Alright, so... Okay. We will do that, but I want to get defeat the warrior Thane in sparring. We're not going to do that. Shaman's crowd. Let's see. Lost and found part two. Karnas, you receive a helmet he lost in the drench fort. Hammer's forge. Book of the dead. We still haven't done that. All right, so let's, let's try this one out. Like I said, I want to kind of dedicate this one... This is dedicated to the one I live. I'm going to kind of dedicate this one to side quests, which I tend to do when I play expansive role-playing type games. Because I like building my characters up. I like being over-leveled. I still, to this day, do not understand why people play role-playing games and want to go through without being significantly leveled. It just doesn't make any fucking sense to me. No, I'd like to die a lot. Like, how stupid is that? Just be over level. This way you can get through it quicker. Especially if you're doing like a let's play or a walkthrough. You really want to be over leveled because you want to get through it quick. You want to be able to avoid death and such. Alright, well, this is the way... Alright, so if I'm out here now, where are we going? Alright, so it's in the drench fort. Um, Alright, so let's fast travel there. The drench fort. Make it an A, it'll be fart. The drench fort. Now then, Drench Fort, we are. And suddenly, we don't have a waypoint. Why did you just disappear? So I just have to be in here? Like, I don't have any real clue as to where this piece of armor is? It's just... Oh, yeah, it's here. Well, as you can see, there's water everywhere now, so... I don't want to go through where I just went through again. I need an indication as to where this thing is. I didn't imagine that there was a place I hadn't seen. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sure I've been up here, though. When I think about it, I can't really go too far in this place because some of the doors are closed. Yeah, no, I've been here. <laughs> oh, where'd you drop your armor piece, you stupid asshole? I was supposed to find it while I was going through. Just one of those things you kind of kind of have to find. I don't want to have to look this up. What was it? A helmet.
It's accepted, isn't it? Dust? What do you see? Show me where the helmet is. I don't see a helmet here. You're supposed to show me where the helmet is, you bird. Show me the way. Where's this helmet? <gasps> oh, I can't stand when they do that. I don't see a helmet there either. I see a plate. Oh, not up. Bird, you are not showing me anything. I don't want to go through the whole place again just to find this helmet. Come on. Help me out. That's what you're here for, isn't it? It should be highlighted like the plate was highlighted. Show me the way. I am not seeing a helmet anywhere. Where are you taking me? Keep flying up there. There's nothing there. about underneath this pool? I, mean, I know I've been here, but maybe I missed something? Mm, doesn't look like it.
Where could you have dropped this? And it's not in a chest, so it's not like if I missed the chest, I would see it. It's it's not that way. What's that? Did I never go in a room before? Is there a room I've never been to? Is that what this is? How have I never been to this room before? Maybe I just decided not to go in it or something? Could have been something I missed. Just kind of overlooked it. Oh, I'll take that. Up oh, and there's the helmet. Gotcha. Alright, there we go. Just because I didn't go to the fucking one room. Okay, what do we got here? Meh. I'm not really into the whole spell thing, so... Okay, so now that that's done, let's get out of here. Let's check the map. So where's Karen? Karen! Where the hell'd you go? Are you still by that? That's the Shattered Ford. Forge. Where the hell did he go? Uh, let's go. Let's go here. All right, because he was here, right? So let's fast travel here. I mean, when I'm doing side quests, I don't care about fast traveling because I'm going to level up anyway. It always bothers me when games that were made five, six years ago have a better concept of combat than games that are made recently. This one has all the elements of a, a video game you'd like that would keep you playing and everything and still games to this day have a hard time mastering these concepts. I tell you one game I would like to play is Xenoblade Chronicles. I played X and I'm gonna play two. But I've never played the original one. I've seen playthroughs of it. It's not like I haven't seen playthroughs of it. I just wanna put Charlotte in a bikini, I think. How do you make the King Lear put the Queen in a bikini? Because that's what Xenoblade is all about. Or Xeno Gears or Xeno Saga. It's all about putting hot chicks in bikinis. Oh yeah, and there's some kind of role-playing elements to it too. <coughs> Excuse me. What the hell are you doing out here, you asshole? Redfield, you asshole! Shit. Well, there's Vulgrim, but I don't have enough gold for him. And I don't have the pages. I could rectify that by going out here. And just scouring the lands. I keep putting... Wow, now that's a critical strike. But then again, these guys are level 1s and 2s. So I obviously will have a better chance of critical striking them. Well, I still haven't gotten that chest. What in the hell are you doing out here?
the nook. You're in the nook. I gotta find you too now. You idiot. We're probably over leveled for this. Oh, wait, I've been here before. Probably over leveled for this. So that's what the Maker's Key does. Now we have a construct that can destroy anything. But what it really does is it does this. Yeah, we have to go like this. Oops. <laughs> Mount it. That's what they're really for, but they can attack enemies. And they can destroy those things too. Ow. Critical strike. Nice. I'll take the level up. So many of you. All right, let's level up.